<clears throat> Hello, redstone engineers and pioneers. Echo here. And I have a really cool concept today. And funny enough, I actually discovered this by accident. Now, I don't know if I'm the first person to find this, but I think I am. And if I'm not, I'm sorry. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe I am. So the way this works is... Basically, as you can probably guess from the, from the title, it's, a, it's an item elevator. Or a lift. Probably what I'm going to call it, because lift sounds cooler. And basically, it just shoots items up to the top. Oh, and my, my anti-night thing's going to kick in in a few seconds, because it's awesome. And so, it will take any type of block. See, look, I can throw in this block of redstone. Yeah, I wait for it to hit the ice. Then when it hits the ice, you just push this button. And then if you want to see proof that it works, I'll just go up here. And then, poop, pops right up. And then, I'm going to get down just by jumping down here. And so, it can use multiple items as well. See, I'll throw in this, and this, and this. And this works for any item that you can drop, so anything that's like floating like that. So let's just uh, push that. And it actually is quite fast. See, watch. You can see him just flying up. Now, this is up 16 blocks, which is a considerable height. So let's just drop down here. And a really cool thing is, you can use pretty much as much items as you want. So look, I'm going to throw in my pick. I'm going to throw in my sword. Block of redstone. I'm going to throw in this anvil. The nether wart. And the emeralds, and I'm gonna let it all go in there. And see, it's all in there. And so, watch. I push this, get shot up, I teleport up, and see it coming up. And then, you also you want to have this border. You don't want us to have glass and then blocks around it. You want to have it going extra one up, because if it doesn't, it'll like shoot out. It actually, it actually looks pretty funny, but it will fly out of the uh, of the tube when you're not um, careful. Now, funny enough, this came to me by accident. I was playing around with some uh, map mechanics for, like, maybe a custom map or something, and I accidentally dropped the block, and then it went into a water stream, and then it went up, it activated a wooden pressure plate, and it passed it, and then it kept going with on the water stream, and then the delayed piston shot it up in the glass, and it, like, just flew up, and I thought it was pretty cool. So I started playing around with it, and I eventually came up with this design. And you could use this for, like, um, farming or something. See, it's kind of the opposite of, um, of a dropper. Because, you know, it's a lifter. <laughs> or a hopper. It's the opposite of a hopper. It's more of a lifter. So that's just my cool concept design. And if you're wondering how you build it, um, it's actually not that difficult. You just gotta... You know, I'll break this. All this is, is, um, it's just a delayed, uh, repeaters connected to sticky pistons. So we have a block, and then we have some we have some ice because ice makes things slide faster, and it's all connected to a button right here. And then I have a little teleport command over there connected to a command block. So let's just uh, place these. Oops, that's not right. So let's just put these back, and then I can uh, sign off. I don't know where this goes, so I'm gonna have to look over here. Nowhere apparently. So I magically gained this block out of thin air. So, I'll just, uh, send that away. No one knows about it. But it's still gonna be up here. So, <clears throat> oh, oops. <laughs> well, that's a nice way to sign off. So, audience, have a great day, and stay techie.